Hi, this is Pam Sherritt from Ohio State. We're entering into the optimum time for fall renovations, August 15th to September 15th. And we were talking yesterday with a group of people that are trying to kill Bermuda grass, which is a warm season grass, in cool season turf. And it's very, it's very difficult, very challenging thing to do because Bermuda grass is so aggressive. And we talked about products like Basimid, and then we also talked about the common um, non-selective weed killer, which is Roundup, of course, glyphosate which kills all plants. It's a, it's a systemic herbicide that's taken in by the plant, kills all the top growth and the root growth, etc. But even with something like Bermuda grass, um, it doesn't do, it doesn't kill it all in one go. Typically you have to kill it, see what comes back, kill it again, see what comes back. And the comment was made, well, you know, maybe we'll just add a little more Roundup than normal. And this is not a good idea for three reasons. Um, the label rate of Roundup is what you should stick to, obviously, because if you go with a higher rate of Roundup, number one, you can end up with soil saturation. There are only so many binding sites on that soil that the Roundup will stick to, and if you apply too much Roundup, you end up with free Roundup in the soil solution that will kill any other grass seed that you put out. So that's reason number one. Reason number two is if you put too much out, you can get very quick top burning growth. Uh, it kills the top growth and the, the plant is dead before it has time for that herbicide to move down and, and kill the root system effectively. And then number three is with grasses like Bermuda grass and Kentucky bluegrass and other grasses and creeping bent grass and those grasses that produce a lot of thatch, uh, that Roundup can again be uh, held in the thatch layer in the organic layer and prevent seed germination of your desirable grasses. So it's extremely important, even though you think more might be better, when you're using Roundup, uh, chemicals like that, it's extremely important that you stick to the label rate.